Paris, Reuters, the European Union could put in place regulations to protect its firms doing business in Iran if the United States withdraws from the 2015 nuclear deal and restores extraterritorial sanctions, a senior EU official said on Thursday. European countries have been looking to increase trade with Iran since Paris, Washington and other world powers agreed to lift most economic sanctions in 2016 in exchange for limitations on Tehran a Euro trademark S nuclear program. But US President Donald Trump on January 12 vowed to restore US sanctions unless France, Britain and Germany change what he calls the A Euro worst deal ever a Euro to his liking, effectively putting it on life support until mid-May. While European nations have been adamant that they would stick to the deal should Washington pull out, Europe would need to find ways to limit any impact from possible US sanctions to ensure their firms continue to do business with Tehran. Denis Chaby, head of the Iranian task force at the EUA Euro Trademark S External Action Service, said one of the options would be to restore a Euro or a blocking regulation SA Euro, a system from 1996 that would protect its firms. A Euro we are looking at a number of possibilities. It is not complicated to do it legally in that the legal instrument exists, but it doesn't a Euro trademark T require a huge internal debate a Euro Chaby told a Euro Money conference in Paris. The regulations were agreed in 1996 as a countermeasure to the US extraterritorial economic sanctions against Cuba, which EU governments argued benefited US foreign policy interests at the expense of European sovereignty. A euro or it could be revived or put back, but only if it is clear that the US is putting back sanctions with extraterritorial sanctions and that they are being applied. It can a euro trademark T be done protectively a euro he said. The so-called extraterritoriality of US sanctions law, which apply to foreign firms carrying out transactions in US dollars even if the operations involve non-U.S branches, allowed U.S. authorities to fine French lender BNP Paribas nearly $9 billion, £5.34 billion, pounds, in 2014. Fears of such fines have been one reason preventing major international lenders and firms from returning. Iranian officials have repeatedly said reluctance of major European banks to return to Iran has slowed its economic improvement, calling on European leaders to encourage businesses to return to Iran. Iran a Euro trademark S Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khomeini has praised European signatories of the deal for trying to keep it alive, but has demanded tangible reaction if the United States pulls out of the accord. The European External Action Service, EEAS, set up in 2009, runs a network of diplomats around the globe, drafts policy papers for EU foreign ministers and is led by the EUA Euro trademark S top diplomat Federica Mogherini.